killer. <sighs> well, I just watched episode 34, four or so, and I literally don't know what else. I don't know. I literally don't know what to say about this episode. The episode begins with Boruto fucking getting some sort of lecture from Chino, right? And then everyone's fucking gone. He goes back to the classroom. It's like basically the end of the fucking day and he's surprised everybody's fucking gone, right? Sarada's there for some stupid reason. She's like, oh, they all probably went home. And she says some, she says some shit like, uh, friend, friend, like Boruto's like, uh, oh, aren't friendships like eternal, right? Aren't friendships forever? And Sarada's like, ah, oh, well, you're probably the only one who thinks that, uh, and I'm like, fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. Just piss off. Like, can you not? But, it, it starts there, the intro starts, then fucking Boruto's at a burger place. Then they see this, like, commercial ad or whatever, and it, it's, it's the guy from that one filler episode, uh, like, after the events with Boruto telling Naruto that he has the Byakugan or Byakugan yeah Byakugan I'm, I've been watching Bleach so Byakuya is like on the mind his name so anyways he's like oh I got Byakugan uh, motherfucker and I'm gonna prove it and and rest was filler again it basically is the dude from that episode he lost weight and he now he's eating this fucking fish that is I guess like super fucking tasty and so Borch is like, hey, why don't we all go fucking fishing, right? Let's go camp and fish for this fucking supposedly delicious fish that will stain your fucking mouth forever. And I'm like, oh, okay. That's, uh, that's cool. So Borto gathers up all of the characters, right? So even, like, even, even the character of Sumire, right? A character who we saw in the first arc and we haven't seen since right she hasn't really been doing anything and she's here right she's here in the episode along with Shikadai, uh Inoj and everyone right all the whole main cast you know the main characters and then the side characters that coincide with the main characters right so they're all there they start fishing some caretaker motherfucker at this like camp area is like oh yeah it rained yesterday so this fish eternal carp that's what they call it in the episode uh, it, it was harder to fish for before you know but ever since it rained and the tide kind of went up and shit it's harder to fish now so you can't do it and then Boruto's just like I'm determined to get that fish I'm determined to get that fish and so that way my friendships always last forever Etc. Right. So, him and Sarada Sar Sar have like bullshit conversation. The conversation is like Sarada feels bad because of what she said to Boruto before the episode started. Right. Uh, let alone Boruto gets a fucking nibble on his fucking fish line. Right. And it's the fucking internal carp, of course, because that's the, the that's the plot. It has to happen. Uh, stuff happens. It the fish is fucking ginormous, so it's hard for Boruto to reel it in. Uh, Sarada starts helping him, and this is the only interesting part of the episode, including the last shot after the credits. And that's that Sumire can use the summoning jutsu and summon up like a baby like form of Nue. You know, remember that motherfucker that was the that was literally the size of a tailed beast? Yeah, now it's like a little fucking like cub. It's tiny, but it's adorable, so I, I can kinda of forgive it. But I almost like kinda of wanna say that that's fucking retarded. Because that's like the most broken summoning jutsu that you can have, because this fucker absorbs chakra. So what the hell? And in the episode she makes the fucking fishing rod like unbreakable and shit. And I'm just like, really? Like, what else she can? What else can she do with this? So, everyone shows up. They help Boruto catch the fucking fish. They all eat the fish. They look up in the sky, and, and Boruto's like, "Yeah, let's come back here another time. Let's be friends forever." And I'm like, "Yeah, that's like almost the exact same thing that Naruto kind of did, almost, right? <laughs> like, made his friendships eternal forever, right? So." 
Anyways, they have like this montage of events that happen with the whole group. Uh, it's kind of cool, I guess. But even though it's like, like all the characters are interesting, but they're not interesting to the point where it's like, if one of them died, I almost wouldn't care. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm, I'm just, I'm just being honest. Like, a lot of them just seem like kind of assholes. Like, out of all the fucking characters of this new generation that I find inter interesting, it's literally Shikadai. Shikadai is like the most relatable motherfucker out of everyone. Boruto like, almost like pisses me off. He's not as annoying as like the manga makes him out to be. In the anime, he's actually like kind of okay, but he's still kind of annoying in the sense of he hates his dad for no stupid fucking reason, right? Like in all these episodes, I can kind of forgive him just for being him, but still. So the credits roll out and then the last shot is Toneri on the fucking moon, right? He's like, nothing remains unchanged. Fate is always flowing. It's sad. You can't change anything. Eh. Emo, I don't have eyes anymore. And then for some reason, like, the screen is, like, breaking. So it's like, is there, like, a barrier around the moon so that way Sonari can't come to Earth? Like, like when did, when did that happen, right? Whatever. Sonari says some stupid shit. Uh, something's gonna fucking happen with him. I still don't know. We haven't seen him since, like, what? Like, episode 15? I don't even remember. That's how long ago that was. So, the next episode is basically a fucking parent-teacher conference. That's literally the name of the episode, parent-teacher conference, right? And it's basically Boruto talking to Shino, and Shino's like, what kind of a ninja do you want to be? And then Boruto's like, I don't know. I haven't really put that much thought into it, because I'm a dumbass. I'm like, oh, that's cool. <laughs> I'm like, oh, that's cool. <laughs> I'm like, oh, that's cool. Uh, yeah, just, just, you, just be yourself, man. Does that's, I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and say that's the fucking end of the episode because I, I, I'm gonna go ahead and say that's just the end of the episode because I have nothing else to fucking say. There's nothing else happened. I'm serious. Nothing else happened. The episode, I'm gonna be honest, is okay. It's not as it's not as bad as as I initially thought it was going to be before watching, but it's still not great, and I almost just would recommend not watching it because you're not missing out. So I'm just gonna go ahead and end the video. I'll see I'll see you guys in the next one. I'll upload the super review tomorrow, so expect that. Whatever. I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a wonderful day, and I'm out.